In this presentation we're going to look at probability and in particular sampling without replacement. So here's a question. A bowl contains seven balls, three blue and four yellow. Two balls are drawn successively from the bowl without replacement. What is the probability that both balls are yellow? And what is the probability that both balls are different color? So let's look at the first question here again. Probability that both balls are yellow? Well, this is two independent events. If you consider this, that the first, the first event is that the uh, first ball is yellow. And the probability of that is 4 out of 7. Very simple. Now, here's the second uh, issue. The second ball is yellow. So we've actually got six balls left. And out of that six, three of them are yellow. So the probability that both balls selected are, is the product of these two probabilities. So prob both yellow equals 4 over 7 times 3 over 36 and that is equal to 2 over 7. Now we're going to look at the probability that both balls drawn at random are different color colors. So what we have to consider is that this is the union of two disjoint events. The first event is that the first, here's the first event, is the first ball drawn at random is yellow. And then the second ball is blue. The second of the disjoint events is as follows, that the first ball is blue and then the second ball is yellow. Okay, so we have to find out the probability of this event one and then the event two, we have to find the probability of that and as these are two disjoint events we just simply add the two uh, values together. So we're going to compute the probability of yellow then blue. So in the first instance there are four yellow balls out of seven to be selected. Okay, so that's four out of seven. And the second matter is that there's going to be six balls left over and three of them are blue and three of them are yellow. So anyway, there's three balls left over, three are blue out of six. So the answer to the uh, to event one is simply multiply apply out those two terms. We actually get an answer of two over seven. Now we're going to compute the probability of blue then yellow. So in the first instance, there's seven balls of which three are blue. So the first part of our calculation is three over seven. Now there are six balls left. One has been drawn at random. There are six balls left. One of the blue ones has gone out, so there's only two left. But that means there's still four yellows left. So four yellows out of six. There we have it there. And the answer to that is, again, two over seven. So the overall probability of two different colors is as follows. It is probability. colors is 2 over 7 plus 2 over 7 and that's equal to 4 over 7.